Welcome to Cassiano Easy Math. So this video is about solving another exponential equation. 32 raised to the 2x plus 2 equals 64 raised to 5 plus 16 raised to 10 divided by 1025. And we need to solve for the value of x. And so for those new to my channel, please like and subscribe for more videos. I would appreciate it. All right, let's start solving. First, uh, whenever we're, we're solving uh, exponential equations, uh, take a look at the base as much as possible. All we have to do is uh, we need to have a conform base or at least similar, similar bases. If not, we'll be doing like uh, making uh, some adjustment of the base to make it even or more equal. If not, we'll be using the logarithm and all that. All right. So we have to rewrite the equation again. So 32 raised to the 2x plus 2 equals 64 raised to the 5th power plus 16 raised to the 10th power divided by 1025. So as I have mentioned earlier, our aim is to get a common base that's how we solve exponential equations. That's, that would be the first uh, first move that we do to make it easier for us to solve the equation. All right. Now, if we focus on the left side of the equation, it's number 32 right there. So number 32 can be written the same way as 2 to the 5th power. Since 2 to the 5th power is 32. So that is multiplying 2 by itself 5 times. That's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So 2 times 2, 8 times 2, 16 times 2, 32. Alright, so 5 times. And on 64, will be written the same way as 2 to the 6th power. That's 2 multiplying itself by by itself six times. So alright, one, two, three, four, five, six. Alright, so two times two, four times two, eight times two, sixteen times two, thirty-two times two, sixty-four. That's two to the sixth. So that and sixteen can be written the same way as two to the fourth power. That means multiplying two by itself four times. One Two, three, four. Two times two, four times two, eight times two is sixteen. So we have to replace those numbers. All right. So thirty-two is two to the fifth power. That's two to the fifth power multiplied by the exponent two x plus two equals sixty-four is two to the sixth power. And we have the power of 5 right there, so we multiply by 5. Then plus 16 is 2 to the 4th power. 2 to the 4th power, and since you got the uh, exponent 10 right there, multiply by 10. And that's divided by 1025. And in here, we are applying the, uh, the exponent rule. That is a raised to m raised to n equals a raised to m multiplied by n. That means we're multiplying the exponents. All right, that will be in effect on all of these exponents over here. So let's do that. So in here, that means 2 raised to 5 times the quantity in this uh, inside the parentheses we're distributing 5 so 5 times 2x is 10x plus 5 times 2 is 10 equals 2 times raised to 6 times 5 is 30 plus 2 raised to the 4th power multiplied by 10 that's 2 raised to 40 but by 1025 And in here, this can be written uh, the same way as 
the right side of the equation as 2 raised to the 38 power multiplied by 1 plus 2 raised to the 38th power times 2 raised to the 10th power. And in here, in this exponent, these terms on the right, we're using the the uh, product rule, uh, rule of exponent, that is uh, a raised to m multiplied by a raised to n equals a raised to m plus n. We ended up adding the exponents. We are we're multiplying the same base, different exponent. We end up adding adding the exponents. All right, that will be done on this part. Okay, so we keep going on this. So that's divided by one thousand twenty-five. So in here, that will be, and now it's become clear that we can factor out the 2 raised to the 30th power over here. So that's 2 raised to the 30th 30, 30 power times, what, times the quantity 1 plus what is left on the right side is 2 to the 10th power. Since factoring out 10, 2 raised to the 30th power, okay. So we have now divided by 1025. That's 2 to 10x plus 10. So in here I have rewritten the equation. 2 raised to the 10x plus 10 equals 2 raised to the 30th power times the parenthesis 1 plus 2 raised to 10 divided by 1025. And in here, if we use our calculator, that's 2 raised to the 10th power is equal to 10, 1024. So the numerator, numerator on the right side of the equation will be 2 raised to the 38th power times the quantity 1 plus 1024, all divided by 1025. Simply away further, that is equal to 2 raised to the 30th power times the quantity 1024 plus 1 is 1025. So divided by 1025. That's too close. Get it over here. So 2 raised to the 30th power applied by 1025. Divided by 1025. So that's 2 raised to the 10x plus 10. And now, if you notice the right side of the equation, this now can be cancelled. That becomes 1. So we ended up 2 raised to the 10x plus 10 equals 2 raised to the 30th power. And so in here now, if you notice the base are the same, that means the exponent will be the same. So that is 10x plus 10 equals 30. So now we have to simplify this equation. So we're subtracting 10 over here. We're subtracting 10 on the right side too, the same way. That means this cancels. That's 0. 10 minus 10 is 0. And what we have left here on the left side, 10x is equal to 30 minus 10. That is 20. And finding the value of x, multiply, I mean divide by 10, both sides of the equation. Cancel that. So we have x is equal to 20 divided by 10 is 2. That was our final answer. Next thing to do now is we have to verify our answer. If we did it right, then we have to substitute the value of x to the original equation to confirm. Let's do that. So to check, original equation is 32 raised to the 2x plus 2 equals 64 raised to the 5th power plus 16 raised to 10 by 1025 where value of x is 2 
So on the left side of the equation, 32 raised to 2 times 2 plus 2 equals the right side. And then here the value of 64 raised to the fifth power by using our calculator, it'll be it's a large number that is 1 billion 73 million 741 and 824 then plus the value of 16 raised to 10 is 1.99 that's 1.099517 times 10 to the 12th power divided by 1025. Alright, so in here, left side equation, now 32 raised to 2 times 2 is 4 plus 2 is 6. So and uh, the value of 32 reached to 6 this correction right here in the value of 16 reached to 10 that is 1.099515111 that's 6 to 8 times 10 raised to the 12th power now we have here value of 32 raised to the 6 is the same as the value of 64 raised to the 5th power that is 1 billion 73 741 million uh, 1,073,741,824 so is that equal to that to the right side of the equation all right we'll find that out so by using our cal calculator we add this one right here divide by 1,025 uh, 1, that comes out to 1 billion 73 million 741 and 824 741,824 so that is exactly the same as the right side of the equation this simply means our answer is correct x is equal to 2 so we, ju we have just confirmed the value of x is 2 alright so that's all for now and for those new to my channel Please like and subscribe for more videos. I appreciate your time. Thank you for watching. I see you in the next video. You have a great day, everyone. Bye.